Well, welcome back to Story with Joel Johnson. Thank you for coming back to hear another story. This is my first crack at a personal story, so let's see how it goes. A few months back, I decided I was going to make some brownies. I didn't have much time, so I was going to do it real quick. So I got all my ingredients together, and I got that mixture going, and I made me some brownies. The thing about it, though, is the batter was kind of runny. A lot of liquid in this batter. And I thought to myself, being Joel Johnson, that, hey, I don't make mistakes. Never do I make mistakes. So I figured, well, it must be the brand. Must be a different kind of brownie mix. Something ain't quite right here. But I knew it wasn't me. So I figured, eh, it'll work. So I pour the brownie mix into the, the pan and the dish or whatever you want to call that sucker. And I put that thing in the oven. And uh, it took about twice as long as it would usually take, maybe even a little more than that, before the brownie got done. So I pulled the brownie out of the oven, looked at it. It was a little off color, but I figured it's a different, you know, a different brand, a different brownie mix. It'd be okay. It'd be fine. So I let it sit for a while and... I had two willing participants to help me eat this off-color brownie, my wife and my daughter. So as we began to eat this brownie, me being the salesman that I am, said, wow, tastes a little different, but it's still good, you know? I can still taste the chocolate, it's still okay, it tastes a little different, a little off. Color's a little off, but I'm sure it'll be okay. Uh, my wife wasn't so sure about that. You know, she's the investigator. She was not eating it because it was good, but she was eating it because she wanted to find out what was wrong with it. So she decided to, you know, throw some things at me. Did you put eggs in this? Did you uh, use the right kind of mix? Did you do this, do the right, that right? Did you cook it right? You know, so she's playing the investigator, the detective. My daughter is just a willing participant. She's eating it, you know, because dad made it, so... It'll probably be okay, so she's, you know, sugar, it's chocolate, good stuff. So as we began to eat this brownie, my daughter says, there's something white in my brownie. I said, wait a minute now, white in your, so I, I decided I need to take a look at it. Maybe something dropped in there, something ain't quite right. So I look in her brownie, and it's actually a, uh, well, it's a, it's a scrambled egg, basically, inside her brownie. Apparently, I didn't mix the batter very well so what I do I, I'm, I'm kind of tired of it now I I had runny batter the the brownie cooked twice as long as it should the brownie was off color my wife was playing detective with my brownie I was trying to sell the brownie and had a very hard time doing that and now there's an egg yolk or a, a scrambled egg excuse me in my daughter's brownie so I had enough so what I do, I take everybody's brownie and I say, let's not even eat it. It's no good. I throw it away. Get a spatula and I get the rest of the brownies out of there, out of the pan. And it's really not brownies. It's really more like a sponge because it was kind of, well, a few drips of water kind of came out of it. And I, <laughs> I threw it all away. Now, you ask me, why do I tell this story? I tell this story because in life, sometimes we need... Just a little bit of help. Sometimes we uh, have to get rid of our pride and ask for a little bit of help. And so I figured out what I needed was these things here. And I, after reading the box and the directions on the box, I found out that I did not need a quarter cup of water. Excuse me, I did not need one and a quarter cup of water, which I put in it. One cup and a quarter. All I really needed was a quarter cup of water. So sometimes we need a little bit of help. I hope you find the help that you need. I know you probably need some just like me. And uh, thank you for listening to my story. And I hope you have a great day.